Hi, my name is Jeffrey Myron. I'm Director of Undergraduate Studies in the Department of Economics at Harvard University, and I'm also the Director of Economic Studies at the Cato Institute in Washington, D.C. Legalize weed, legalize, wait, legalize weed, legalize weed, legal, legalize weed, legalize weed, legalize weed, legalize weed, legalize weed. Why shouldn't it be legal? I think that most Americans want to live in a free society, and if a free society, the presumption should be that people get to do what they want unless they are in some significant, tangible uh, way harming others. Simply smoking marijuana isn't hurting anybody any more or less than drinking alcohol is hurting other people, or consuming too much Ben and Jerry's, or not exercising, or driving on the freeway. This is Planet Earth 2. Once the system is fully in place, that Massachusetts can collect tax revenue. It means it can save money by not arresting people for possession and trafficking in marijuana. Um, and it generally should improve respect for the law, respect for civil liberties, uh, and criminal justice enforcement by allowing all that to be focused on things which are really crimes rather than focusing on interfering with people's individual rights. Oh, you're interested in buying a vape? Let me paint you a picture about our sponsors over at Vaporfy. Whoa, <laughs> thanks Aaron. Let me tell you about my favorite company when it comes to vapes, Vaporfy. Whoa, Vaporfy. Mmm, never a bad time or place for a Vaporfy. Zillions of competent, accomplished, high energy, smart, whatever kind of people they consume marijuana all the time. It's impossible to believe that marijuana has those deleterious effects on the brain that people uh, often assert. Already, I've been starting to see a shift in kind of the attitude towards it. You know, it's become more socially acceptable, especially for older people. Um, you know, not like, I'm not talking like senior citizens, but you know, like established adults, you know, people in their 30s to 50s. You know, I've met so many people now that like, you know, like they kind of had to hide it before, but now like, I'm not going to name any names, but there are some parents I know in the greater Boston area that, you know, get together, you know, smoke a few noobs and then have dinner with the kids or whatever. So. Do you think professors smoke? Some professors definitely do smoke, yes. I do not smoke marijuana. Legalize weed. Legalize weed. Legal. Legalize weed. I am actually attending a, a small Libertarian Party meeting uh, in Somerville, Massachusetts on April 20th. Is that Libertarian Party meeting marijuana themed or no? No, it's not marijuana themed. It's just a general get together of people interested in the Libertarian Party. And it just happens to be on 420. <laughs> and I don't, it's probably not a coincidence that it's on 420. <laughs>